Hey everyone, welcome back to Tarot Mystic 1111. This is going to be a general reading for the zodiac sign of Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Let's see what's the overall energy for Virgo. What does Virgo needs to know? If you wish to book a person reading with me, then the link is provided in the description box below. What's the present energy for Virgo? Let's see. We have unicorns, that's the imagery there. Purity, if you draw this card, the unicorns wish to connect with you. Find time to be quiet, preferably out in nature. Think about them and allow them to touch you with the qualities of dignity, love, beauty and grace. They may offer you healing or reconnect you to your soul essence. Remain open to a message from them today. Be prepared for unicorn energy to touch you. So. Basically, it's time to step out of nature and, um, you know, just relax and ground yourself. And if you're seeing a unicorn lately, um, you know, in your dreams or there's a sign or somewhere, you know, in the in TV or, you know, somewhere, some picture of a unicorn, then this is a confirmation from the universe, right? And then let's pull out a romance angel message for you, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus sorry about that so let's see what's the romance angel message for virgo sun moon rising venus <clears throat> okay we have passion wow so allow your heart and soul to sing with joy so there is somebody you feel um you know you have passionate feelings for there's intense chemistry there is attraction you know it's it's a hot connection right um okay so let's see what the tarot has to say this is for virgo sun moon rising venus general reading for virgo what do we need to know what's the present energy for virgo Wow, we have Empress. So you're creating something here, um, Virgo. Again, this is also an Earth energy, but you could be dealing with a Taurus. You could be having a strong Taurus or Libra in your chart. Empress energy. Wow. So this could be your energy, but I feel this is somebody you're, you're attracted to, Virgo. Or maybe somebody is attracted to you. and Because you are kind of... Um, displaying that aura that magnetism that energy that other other people cannot resist you right so that's the kind of energy you were um giving off right now the empress for some of you i feel you could also be um soon hearing some some kind of good news related to pregnancy but things are actually um growing and amplifying for you Empress is also the card of growth and expansion. So I feel uh, whatever right now you're putting your energy, time and effort into it's it's really, you know, going to give you uh, rewards in the future or you might be kind of reaping those rewards right now. For some of you, it's a divine counterpart energy. I feel you're really attracted to somebody here, right? Or somebody is attracted to you. Uh, they find you irresistible. There's a lot of passion here, right? okay and then oh my god lovers again <laughs> again a passionate card here lovers so you could be dealing with a gemini maybe there's a choice to make whether to follow the temptation of the heart uh, of the body and or or whether to follow your heart right so there's this there's temptation here whatever this connection is all about the passion is really really there it's it's intense but you still kind of making a choice here you don't really know if you should go for it yeah queen of pentacles that's your energy right there virgo so you could be kind of really taking your own time deciding about what to do about this connection right maybe you're you're concerned about more earthly matters maybe you're 
um, somebody who's responsible, of course, Virgos are always responsible and diligent people. But right now, your main focus could be your home, your family, or your finances, your career. That's what's your main priority right now. So I feel that you are taking your time out and you're not in a rush to decide because, you know, you, okay, fine, the passion is there, but you want commitment. That is something you, you're seeking because uh, Virgos obviously value commitment, right? So you know that you deserve that kind of a relationship. So passion is there. You feel attracted to somebody here, but then you really don't know if this connection is going to last long because obviously we cannot all survive just on passion. There has to be commitment. There has to be um, loyalty. There are a lot of things that makes a relationship work and that's what you're actually willing to wait for, right? So you're buying your time here. Again, six of pentacles. <laughs> Definitely when it comes to your finances, I see a huge improve in finances here for you Virgo. I feel that um, something huge is coming your way, okay? Maybe this is something that you're working on. If you have your own business, I feel it's it's really, really going to shoot up and you're going to uh, be, you know, earning a lot of amount here, a lot of money is coming to you. So you're basically building a legacy here, okay? And... Um, even in, in, in love relationships, I feel, again, four of pentacles. So many pentacles here. <laughs> okay, and then we have ace of wands. See? Okay, the passion here with somebody is just off the charts, <laughs> Virgo. Really, you're, you're attracted to somebody who's who has got you. It's, it's really difficult to move on from this person. And I feel this is a new attraction. Okay, the passion is really brewing right now. And then we have the tower right we have the tower here so scorpio energy mars energy uh so i feel that whatever this is about i feel this was all unexpected okay this person just came into your life unexpectedly and just um took you off by surprise and now you're just kind of blown away in this in this um intimate connection you don't really know what to do because the passion is so strong and you were not actually expecting this this person is so generous this person feels like a breath of fresh air but you're not really sure will go because i'm seeing mostly your energy here in the card so maybe you're the dominant one here in this connection and you're trying to really weigh your options you don't know if you should go forward and you know if you should uh, even talk to this person you know even think about this 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 prospective uh whatever this this connection is maybe it's somebody who really sees a future with you because this person is super attracted to you but you don't know if uh you should be putting your energy back into this connection this is somebody new who uh, has definitely um you were not expecting to arrive in your life this is a very unexpected person but there's definitely, this could also be a twin flame or a soulmate connection because you both uh, strongly, you know, there's there's a strong pull towards each other, a magnetic pull. But you're more concerned about the, like I said, early matter. So you're like more, um, you're, 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 you're thinking more about commitment and long term, you know, you, you have, you know, your long term goals. So you're more concerned about that. So you're not really um, ready to you know trust this connection so you're still making a choice Virgo but I feel that it's safe for you to trust I think um, this person is equally generous and you should give give back to this person because it's going to really whatever you put into this connection it's going to amplify we have the Empress here so I feel this is going to go long term and maybe you can even settle down with this person you both you know, this connection is going to grow and expand in the future. So if you have trust issues, just keep those issues aside because I feel that it's really this connection is going to go somewhere and um, you could even get, you know, married to this person here because I see them as your divine counterpart. There's so much growth and expansion here. This connection is, is going to bring in for you. Maybe unicorn is a sign that you you need to see uh, before you finalize your decision. But I feel that yes, passion is there, intense connection. It's an intense connection. Attraction is mutual, and this person is kind of left you like unstable. You you really don't know your energies are like you know oh my god what has happened? Why am I feeling so attracted to this person? But it's it's really a blessing from the universe, and they're there to really um, help you grow and expand and. And just be careful if, if you're, um, you know, 
having these intimate moments with this person just be careful because there's a there's a high uh, probability that you might just end up getting pregnant so um, take all precautions but I feel this is really a passionate connection here and you're still thinking about commitment all right and um, in your work uh, in your career I feel your focus is right now on your work on making money and um, there could be a partnership that you might want to uh, you, you might be thinking about or a collaboration or you know um, just kind of getting into a partnership with someone here but you have your second thoughts you're still thinking about you know because you have trust issues so you're really kind of holding tight onto your money um, not really wanting to spend uh, on this partnership or not really willing to trust this person here but I feel it's safe to trust this this new venture whatever this new maybe you have a new creative idea that you want to explore and a new creative venture or even a business idea that you want to really um, materialize and it's it's really going to give you huge profits because i feel that you're going slow you know you have set your goals and you know what you want out of this idea and it's really going to go a long way so it's something that's going to give you long-term return so you can go ahead and um because you i see you really career focused right now and there's a huge amount of money coming your way huge uh, increase in finances and i feel this is going to be unexpected um you're not going you're not you're not seeing this coming here but uh unexpected source of income maybe somebody is about to generously um uh, i don't know your boss is giving you some sort of a monetary benefit or um you know pay raise or some sort of surprise gift it's it's is coming your way. so whatever is happening in your life right now it's really growing helping you grow and expand um, a lot of your aspects um you know in your life your love relationships it's it's just about trust here because you're not trusting virgo that's where it's kind of creating a block otherwise i see everything going super for you especially this new love intense love and passion <laughs> all right virgo so that was the um energy update for you let me know in the comments below if it resonates or not please do like share and subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in the next one thank you so much for watching